Hello everyone, welcome to Infijan. In this very very exciting video of algebraic challenging equations, we are going to solve an interesting equation cube root x plus 28 minus cube root x minus 28 equal to 2. So let's get begin with substitution. I am going to write x plus 28 as a and x minus 28 as b. So if I will write a is equal to x plus 28 and b equal to x minus 28 and I am going to subtract both the equations because I don't want x so change of sign I will consider both the terms will get cancelled out which is with x term see this term will get over what we will have a minus b equal to 56 this is our equation number one now what will be the original equation? See, it is cube root of A minus cube root of B equal to 2. This is our equation number 2. So, from these two equations, we will find out A and B first. Then we will get to know about what is the true value of x. Alright. Now, I am going to write one identity. I am writing a minus b whole cube as p minus q whole cube because a and b we have already considered. So that formula is p cube minus q cube minus 3 p cube in bracket p minus q. This is what we know. Now it's time to apply here. How I can apply? By taking cube of this equation. Once I will take cube of this equation then p minus q I will apply so p cube so cube root of a cube so I will have a minus b minus 3 the product of both so let me write cube root of a b directly and cube root of a minus cube root of b so I can write 2 okay this bracket is 2 equal to 8 okay now a minus b, a minus b is 56, you can see equation number 1, I will apply here. So 56 minus 6 cube root of ab equal to 8. Alright, now I will take 6 term to the right and 8 to the left. So it will become 48 is equal to 6 times cube root of ab. So, cube root of AB will become 48 over 6, 8. After taking cube both sides, I will get AB equal to 8 cube, which is 512. Done. That means, let me write here, AB is equal to 512. Remember, it is 8 cube. Now, what I will do? See, Equation 1 is already there in terms of A and B. Equation 2 from here I will collect B is equal to 512 divided by A. This value I will put in 1. In equation 1. So let's apply in equation 1. A minus B is 56. 56. And second equation is what I am substituting that is B equal to 512 over A. Now let's put the value. Okay. So A would be as it is A minus B 512 over A equal to 56. Then multiply this equation with A. A square minus 512 equal to 56A. Take all the terms to left hand side a square minus 56a minus 512 equal to 0. Now we know that 512 is 8 cube or in other words 8 times 8 times 8. So let me write 64 into 8. Now see 64 minus 8 is 56. Now we can split the middle term. You can use the quadratic formula also. So I am going to show you the splitting of middle term. So I will write a square 
माइनस सिक्सटी फोर ए प्लस एट ए सेंट्रल टर्म माइनस सिक्सटी फोर प्लस एट इज माइनस फिफ्टी सिक्स रेस्ट इज अनचेंज नाउ आई विल टेक ए कॉमन फ्रॉम दीज टू सो आई विल गेट ए माइनस सिक्सटी फोर एंड फ्रॉम दीज टू टर्म्स आई विल टेक एट कॉमन सो ए माइनस सिक्सटी फोर Overall, I will have a minus sixty-four in one parenthesis and a plus eight in other. So, in totality, I am having a equal to sixty-four or minus eight. All right. Now, remember what was our substitution? This was our a. This was our b. So, let us consider only a. so here i will consider two cases separately first one is x for a64 let me write here a64 what will happen and then we will see for a negative a8 what will happen what value of x will come out all right let's check i am putting a is equal to 64 x plus 28 equal to a X plus twenty eight equal to sixty four. X is equal to sixty four minus twenty eight thirty six. Yes. So it is plus thirty six. Remember. Now come to second case. A is equal to minus eight. So I will write same equation. Our substitution. X plus twenty eight equal to a. A is minus eight. X is equal to minus eight minus twenty eight. So x is Minus thirty six. Now we will write our final answer or final solution. That is, x is equal to plus minus thirty six. Now let us check, verify which solution is true. Either plus thirty six or minus thirty six or both. Let me verify. Verification. i am writing first case as x is equal to 36 so i will put here 36 plus 28 cube root minus cube root 36 minus 28 let's check whether it is coming out two or not okay so i will write 36 plus 28 that is 64 Cube root minus cube root of thirty six minus twenty eight eight. So this value is four. This is two. Answer is two. That means it is true. True. Now come to second value minus thirty six. Same job. I will write here cube root of minus thirty six plus twenty eight. Minus cube root of minus thirty six minus twenty eight minus thirty six plus twenty eight is minus eight cube root minus this is minus sixty four cube root. Now we know that it is minus two, and this value is cube root of minus sixty four is minus four. So minus two plus four. Which is plus two, true. Okay, that means this value is also true. So final solution is plus minus thirty six. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for paying attention. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck.